In this video, we are at the British Iron Works Centre. Believe me, the name is not enough. This place is amazing. So much art, so much um, weirdness. Let's go and check it out. Uh, yeah, it's going to be that sort of a day, I guess, where um, you got ogres and monsters and all sorts everywhere. What a, just a shop. chaotic! This is just a shop. Amazing. Um, yeah, all this stuff. Teapots for bir feeding birds. Roger Moore. Why have not? Massive dragons. Blimey. 990 pounds for the mini coffee table. Holy smokes. Uh, I'm guessing bikes, judging by the rev counter there. That, that's a cat, apparently. Friend of Ovnov. Oh. Ah. This is astonishing. And there's a cafe just through there. It sounds very busy. Blimey. Should we go and find the, um, the actual art? Yeah. Oh no, I am hypnotized. Whoa. Ah, we have found the blacksmith's workshop. Very wisely, they're keeping us out because uh, some uh, plasma cutting going on over there. But look at it. Wonder what they're making next. Yeah. I can't imagine, to be honest. Could be anything. So we've got um, space available for artisans. So if you're feeling artistic and want to sell your wares, uh, they do have a place here. This is Ned's shed. A beautiful. Handcrafted creations. Very busy showing people around. That looks more like the, the smellies. So, Miss Hubner wants a rusty pig. Rusty pig hasn't got a price on, sorry. I just called him Wilbur. Non rusty pig, £299. Some lovely patination going on with the pigs. Oh, get censored for that sort of thing. There were boobies. What naked ones? Yeah. These mad rabbits or hares, I suppose. Yeah, it does say large rabbit, just 99 pounds for a large, terrifying rabbit. Wow, blimey! This is a remarkable place. Ah, the swings are already taken, bit of a shame. So, why are we here? Well, I've seen this place on social media and it just absolutely hasn't done it justice. From the second you cross the threshold, it's absolutely crazy. There's so many things to see. Giraffe. Just everywhere. Giraffe bench, bench. because why not? Because why not? Big giant gorilla. Yeah, why King not? Kong. So, it's over 70 acres and it's family run and they've got 100 team members here, um, which is fantastic, you know, great for the community and whatnot. And uh, it's the British Ironworks Centre and then it's Shropshire sculpture park and they've got some amazing pieces i believe they've got a spoon related piece that involved yuri geller um i think they've got the knife angel here as well from knife amnesties Ooh. some really good messages and whatnot but what an incredible space yeah and it's 10 Remarkable. pounds for adults but we did get a uh, ticket for a free return visit we did under 12s are free and their concession list is absolutely massive even if yeah. you're one of their facebook top fans you're a concession. If you live in an <laughs> SY postcode, which I used to do when I lived in Devil's Bridge, which is nowhere near here, uh, you're on the concession list. Mm -hmm. You're a top fan on their Facebook page. Uh, if you're a refugee, um, yeah, it just goes on and on. And uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's just an amazing space. <laughs> and it's in a big loop, so you walk around. They've got a safari that we're going to join in a minute, I think. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm just mind blown. Oh, yeah. superheroes and villains. Oh, okay. Let's go and have Sculpture a look. Sculpture exhibition. Let's go and look. Look out for the minions. Uh, do they come under superheroes or villains? Uh, well, it's a, it's, a, it's a fine line with a minion. Yeah. But this is definitely the Hublet's kind of stuff. Oh, watch your step on the way in. Oh. Oh. Wow. Ah, oh, Groot! <gasps> awesome. Groot says, grow your own. Oh, very nice. Uh, Darth Vader there. Oh, these are incredible. Yeah, yeah. And do you want to come in for a, a sense of scale on Okie dokie. I don't really give a great sense of thick scale because I'm four foot eight. 
<laughs> How big? Deadpool, awesome. Mm. Looking forward to the new movie. And I apologise today if I don't get all the niche references because I get a certain amount. This is why Mini Hub Not's going to hate us. Is that our second bumblebee of That's the day so far? That's a huge bumblebee. Let's just show how big bumblebee is. Yeah, a bit Woof. of a height difference. Optimus Pro, wow. When I mean, you come in close, it's made up of everything. Nuts and bolts, washers, cogs. Wow. And we're quite sad because we recently got rid of our washing machine. We did. And uh, they, they want, want washing machines. They want and I think, washing you machines. Can, I think you can guess what happens to the washing machines. Yeah. Stormtrooper. Yeah. That's, oh, what's his name? Hellboy? Oh gosh, I'm going to get shot down by the yeah. internet. <laughs> gosh. Wow. Oh, watch out, this minion has a gun. Uh, that Hulk certainly is incredible. Blimey. It is. Right, here we go. We're going on the extinction trail. Yeah. So, going to take us about 25 minutes, it says, so just over a kilometre. But oh, we yeah. can see the animals going into the distance. Look. Yeah, woolly mammoth there. And the gosh, I have no idea what that one is. A lovely Which rhino. One? Uh, the big thing on the hill. Big thing on the hill. Oh, we can... Appears to have car doors as wings. <laughs> can you recognise the car part? Is the important question. No, I'm struggling a bit. Maybe when we get closer. What are they called? Oh, Devin would tell me. Oh, polar bears. The magnificent three-headed dragon. Is it a hydro with there. three heads? I think it might be a hydro. Yeah. yeah. Uh, next to King Jung Un on his missile. <laughs> <laughs> Unsurprisingly, it, it, it's art. There are some fairly serious um, hippie-ish messages. messages, but but they're <laughs> done with good humour. Oh, leopard coming down a tree trunk. Wow. Oh. oh, okay. That's why they want washing machines. They want to build the world's biggest Rubik's cube. That's awesome. So yeah, this is the entrance where we drove in. We are very close to Oswestry in Shropshire, very close to the Welsh border. So uh, a lovely spot. And for us, a lovely day to visit. Uh, Miss Hubner has found a hippo. It's beautiful. That's amazing. Oh, just the, the color of the metal yeah. and everything. And this uh, zebra. zebra. Oh. Absolutely delightful. And everything's informative as well. There's information on every animal. Yeah. And also... QR codes to find out more. There's a minion trail. And on the minion trails, they've got minion ease, min the minion's language. So it's just incredible. <laughs> We're now in the critically endangered zone. Chinese pangolins there. And uh, right next to the road by the sound of it. You definitely need your um, walking legs. Yes. It's, it's a big However, old sight. However, it's two loops. There's that smaller loop and we're just doing the bigger loop. Yeah, yeah. We're gone for it. Yeah, we are committed. Ah, yes, of course. The very rare spider minion. They are uh, very rare. Very rare to see one. Could be endangered. As are the Philippine porcupines. That's a lot of spikes. Wow. Many minions to be found. Oh, Miss Hubnut has fallen in love with Spider Minion. <laughs> it's this guy, actually. It is amazing. Oh, loving the dolphin. Beautiful, riding the waves. Wow, I didn't even know swordfish were that endangered. Poor swordfish. And, uh, this elephant looks mightily impressive. What elephant do we think? Uh, it's got African. smaller ears. Oh, it's an Asian one. Ah, see, smaller ears. Smaller ears. It's the patina they're all developing that's really quite special, yeah, yeah. isn't it? It's amazing. 
beware of the bear. You're never quite sure <laughs> oh, what's going to turn up. Yeah, yeah. The more you look, the more you see. The more you see. And look, we've got lots about British wildlife as well. Yeah, mini beasts. See. Wow. This is a big sight. I think you definitely get your tenors worth. <laughs> oh, well, do you see my pair of happy monkeys? Wow. And yet they've all got signs on them saying they're a work in progress, which I guess Nature's is the doing rust. the work. Yeah, she was even getting closer to that massive sculpture in the middle. That is uh, quite something. Well, we've come closer. This thing is huge. I mean, bear in mind that gun, the end of the gun is a car wheel. And what are these headlights? Is a Land Cruiser? Wow. And again, for a sense of scale. What? You use me again? Yeah, here, here is a Miss Hubnut and there is the enormous sculpture on the hill. That is insane. There is so much detail to it. Look. Got all the cogs, gears, bits of pipe. The dedication to find two, like his legs, are repetitions. Yeah, yeah. To find two of everything. Amazing. Yeah, I would say that is more than an afternoon's work. A woolly mammoth. We've got a tank over there. We've got a peacock over here and then we've got Anubis. Anubis, Anubis sorry. That which uh, I'm guessing that oh, sometimes you can climb up the colour. to the top of. That is amazing. Wow. The jackal god of ancient Egypt and yeah, this blue absolutely astonishing. There are some amazing sculptures here. Probably why it's a sculpture park. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Like oh, and you can do archery because why not? Yeah, they seem to have archery set up next door. Marvellous. One of the lovely things is how the sculptures interact with their surroundings. Uh, these creatures jumping over a fence. Beautiful. I see a millipede up to no good over there. Yeah, we're both going to check that out. Yep. Uh, we've got an archer here, but we seem to be missing most of the archer. First, that designates it's the archery. Look at that. Oh, wow. Amazing. Gorilla apocalypse, apparently. It's an environmental protest. There we go. Centaur for uh, Sagittarius there. That is, um, again, incredible. Look what it is made up of. Wow. Unfortunately, their own van has been consumed by a giant millipede. It's awful when that happens. Holy smokes, how many golf clubs went into this? The world's longest millipede. Look at that. It's enormous. And then, look at that. Whoa. Amazing place. Uh, Miss Hubner is giving uh, the spider a wide berth. It's going to get you. Give Spider-Man a whole new meaning. Is that freaking you out as well? Yeah, I'm not overly keen. I'm uh, just admiring the uh, rubber sharks made out of old tyres right next to the cafe here, where we just did have our lunch. I'm afraid we didn't film it. No, it was, <laughs> take our word, Rubbish. it was delicious. Particularly the chips. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, the um, service was slowed somewhat by a couple of um, coach loads coach of people. Loads. Yeah, yeah. But, but uh, once we had the, food, the chips, 
chip's amazing. Mm -hmm. And the toilet's quite interesting, I yes, believe. I'm not going to do been... spoilers. because No, really... no, you have to come and see them yeah, for you yourself. Yeah, have to come and see. Yeah. Right, let's go and see what else there is, because there's some more amazing sculpture. Right, we are back on the trail, suitably refreshed. They obviously don't like Jaguars here, or maybe they do, and they like turning them into art. That's uh, a Terminator, isn't it? Maybe it is, yeah. I think so. One heck of a gun. Wow. Again, the level of detail is uh, astonishing. Oi. Very impressive. Now we're going to go and walk around this section. Here, yeah, Gorilla just scratching his back there. We've got um, a, a biplane again. It's made out of cogs and wheels and clutch plates and gold knows what. Astonishing. Just gathering these parts must take ages. Yeah, yeah, and, it, and it's a replica engine as well. That's not a real engine. Someone has made a radial engine out of scrap. Astonishing. There is some serious talent here. Yeah. There's a dinosaur. And some pigs. Oh, dinosaurs. Dinosaurs and pigs. I'm loving the pigs. I am just, they're just really nicely captured, aren't they? Yeah. Just snuffling. Certainly wouldn't get, want to get be between this pair and their breakfast. Um, well, you might end up being breakfast, I suppose. More impressive colour coordination and a big old head. We Did saw you say from a, a big old early. thing? A big old head. Oh. A work in progress there. And then more dinosaurs. Well, I think that's going to be it. Um, just um, checking out uh, security here. Um, yeah, British Ironworks Centre, what an amazing place. There is just so much to see. We've been here for hours and we, we feel have. like we've seen a fraction of it, to be honest. You could walk around it for many, many hours indeed. So excellent value, good food, mm -hmm. and uh, some photo opportunities all over the place. So and thank you very much. Oh, sorry. Exciting toilets. Exciting toilets. I haven't even checked out the oh, exciting see. toilets yet. See. Yeah, exciting toilets. So there you go. Thank you very much for watching this little Hub Notes. And uh, if you're in the area, do pop along. Bye.